was a small thing I was thinking about today is how much more challenging it makes your life if you think it's you against the world if you pretty much hate everybody else out there see people as burdens and horrible things that are just in your way and I don't know I'm just kind of inspired by you know life I've been reading a lot of books and I see all these people who've made lots of money and been really successful and how much they're helped by other people they they face plenty of obstacles and many of those obstacles are in the form of other humans but there are other other people that join forces with them see things from different perspectives have ideas that they wouldn't have had on their own and it like all meshes together and makes one giant great thing so I think it's better to see people with like more of a neutral eye anyway like where you're willing to give them a chance knowing that just like you they came into this world without an instructor's manual like this is what you do to be a proper human you know we don't have one of those it's, I mean some religions think we do but like it's just you know we're all just kind of here and clearly some people make choices that don't make the lives around them better <laughs> and that's annoying but if you make yourself an island and hate everybody you have to do so much more work like I know and then like if you throw that hate out there too much it makes everybody want you to fall like like if you go out like just think like what vegan gains did where instead of like maybe taking some of the things he learned as a vegan training and trying to enrich the lives of others by sharing that he just goes and like starts trashing everybody that's like done well on YouTube talking about how they're the worst of the fitness industry when a lot of these people have a ton of fans because they've shared knowledge they've learned and it's helped these people so his cause is good but I don't like the way he goes about supporting it and that's what I'm saying like you can have a good cause but if you go about supporting it incorrectly people just want you to fall on your face instead of seeing your cause succeed and even like vegan gains though he might go in the face of people he still has like this huge vegan community behind him that supports him so even he's not 100% on his own like there's all these people that are like yeah look he's our champion he's got 87,000 subscribers and it's like dude why are you supporting somebody that uses these kind of tactics but sometimes people want a champion so bad they don't care how he conducts himself but I, I had other examples in my head too is and even those examples of like they seem like they hate the whole world but then they like have all these people buy their e-products and shirts and stuff so they still have fans they still have other people supporting them so don't think of every other human as like a stupid waste of space because you can find a lot of surprises I remember back many years ago when the world was a different place when I'd take bus trips and train rides and stuff and sometimes some pretty interesting people would cross paths with me and start bouncing ideas around and you get to hear cool stories because when you only have one life there's only so much you can do there's only so much time so sometimes when you get to know other people you start hearing other stories and kind of get like these cool vicarious experiences because they did something really cool that you're never going to have the chance to do because there's only so much time in your life so 
I'm just saying maybe at least view people neutrally, like give them a chance, let them prove they suck before you just write them off as total trash. And I think it will help make your life a little bit more enjoyable and less challenging.